Hi, this is Brandon with eParts. We're in our warehouse here today to do a quick video review of the new stabilizer kit that we're offering for the BX series Kubota tractor models. The stabilizers that come standard on the BX tractors is, are the turnbuckle style stabilizers. Um, our kit is a solid telescopic stabilizer that one is a lot easier to adjust, um, especially on those turnbuckle stabilizers when they get a little dirty or rusty, they can become really hard to adjust to the pattern you may need. And two, they are a lot heavier duty upgrade, so they're not gonna bend quite as easy as those turnbuckle stabilizers and end up lasting you a lot longer. This kit will come with both the left hand and right hand stabilizers, as well as all of the mounting hardware needed. That includes the two mounting pins on each side with the cotter pins, and as well as the adjustment pin with a hair clip pin there in the middle. Um, the install is quite easy and simple. We'll put a video of that here at the end, um, but it should take you less than 10 minutes to get the old ones off and get these down and in place. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to reach out to us. We're always more than happy to help. Look up your model um, and see if these will fit for you or find you another part that you may need. Um, we carry a wide range of items, including replacement seats, seal kits, cylinders, and countless other parts. So if you have any questions, please feel free to re reach out to us. We're always more than happy to help. Um, so we'll put a video now of the install and uh, let us know if you have any questions. Thank you. So when going to install the new stabilizer, what you wanna do is remove the cotter pin on the tractor side on the bottom side of the clevis. And then you'll be able to pull that pin out. And then on your lower pull arm side, you'll pull that pin out. And now you're ready to install the solid stabilizer. On the tractor side, you'll put the flat bar. You can use your original pin, but we also do include that pin. And install the cotter pin on the bottom side, which we also do include with the kit. On the pull arm side, you'll wanna make sure to install the solid stabilizer with the tabs facing outward. That'll allow you to adjust this and not for them to rub against the pull arm. You want to install the cotter pin on the bottom side of this pin as well. And then your adjustment pin will go in the middle right here. Once you have the stabilizer kit installed, to adjust these, it's a really simple process. All you have to do is remove the hair clip pins on the bottom side of the adjustment pin. Remove those adjustment pins and they'll slide and you'll be able to adjust them to wherever you may need them. To lock them in place, all you need to do is drop that adjustment pin back in, install that hair clip pin, move this one, adjust it to where you may need it, drop that pin in, and you can adjust those very quick and easily and no tools required at all. We wanna give a special thank you to our friend Fred for letting us borrow our, his tractor and letting all of our customers see how to uh, install and use a stabilizer kit. So thanks Fred.